to Blind Date. I am your host, Moira Black, and tonight one lucky fella will be going on a date with our wonderful Mayor Paloma Swinnon. Say hello, fellas. Well, uh, my name's TJ. Uh, I've been single now for, uh, cool, what we're we looking, I don't know, as long as Diamond Daniels has been dead. And I'm, uh, I'm looking to, to find someone that likes uh, leather uh, and chains and uh, riding hard and fast. My name is Zach Zimmerman. Some people call me Hype Man Zach Zimmerman. I love to bring the vibes, good energy. I love to have a good time. And I'm here to see if I can win a lucky date. 77, uh, no man's show, Vespucci PD, probably the greatest cup to ever live, honestly. Uh, my colleagues will agree. Um, they're also great themselves as well. I'm actually ranked number one, North America and the Wales service. Uh, yep, pretty much. Just the greatest we ever live, honestly. I'm looking to find my uh, lucky woman, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Tonight we have Bachelor oh number God. one. Excellent stuff. And then we'll have Bachelor number two. He my and favorite. then Bachelor number three. Oh, I changed my mind. Yeah. Oh, yeah, excellent yeah. stuff. Yeah, good work, Ooh. dickheads. Ruin oh, boy. Oh, please don't spray that on me. Alright, okay, oh, if we man. have you all take your seat. Oh, spread this shit all over. Let me figure out to see it. Paloma. Paloma. Ain't she my Paloma? There we go. Excellent. So we're going to have you ask the bachelors a series of questions. We'll have you um, go, like ask each one specifically. We've got it so that we've got one will be male on the far right. Two will be the male in the middle, and three will be the male on the far left. So when you ask your questions and uh, you indicate who you're asking, that that bachelor will answer. Um, I believe you have a, a list of questions there. Mm -hmm. Hi, do. Um, I am Paloma Swinton. I'm old. Let's just say that pretty damn old. I like to work. I'm a workaholic and. There's nothing more special about me, to be fair. Excellent. So let's start off with, with your first question of the night, Paloma. Who hmm. would you like to aim this question to? Hmm. Let's aim it to Bachelor I'm One. Here. Let's start it safe. The question is... What is your perfect first date? My perfect first date would be uh, down on a beach with maybe somebody playing a guitar, a nice uh, campfire, and uh, just get to know each other. Good to know. Would you like to aim that question at any of the other contestants, or would you like to move on to a new new question? Mm, let's aim that question at contestant T. Um, I think the perfect first date would be a drive in the hills, have a scenic view of the ocean, Smoke some weed, listen to some music, and just get to know each other. Oh dear. Oh, she Are you wanting to do a new question, Ploma? Um, yes, let's do that. Um, for contestant two, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is blue. I'm diehard blue. Eyes are blue. I love blue. Even though I'm wearing red today, I do love blue. Let's get okay. some questions for for contestant number three in here. Um, contestant number three. Who do you think is more attractive? So now Overlin or Elspeth Overlin? I'm pretty sure they're sitting straight in front of you. Oh my god. God damn. I'd have to say that it's probably both of them, honestly. Two beautiful that, women, that, right there. That's a cop up, man. Right? Answer. Left to choose. Oh hell yeah! The one on the left all day long. Oh my god. Thank you. That's a loser ass answer, please. Call me. Hmm. Yeah, I can keep going, right, Miss Black? Yep. Just keep on asking questions. Um. Contestant number one. Well, he probably said he wanted to be up there. What is your favorite dish? Dish. My favourite dish. Mm -hmm. mm, see, I would, uh, I would like to say my favourite dish would be a food, but I'd, I'd love to serve you up and eat you. Oh. Ooh. 
Oh, oh my shit. God. The I have not just heard that. The that black man is. You yeah. killed my, my brother. Oh, yes, that I patch, please. What would contest the number two be the favorite dish? She said two? Yep, mm -hmm. number two. Favorite dish? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love a big mm -hmm. meaty oh, pizza. Meat lover's pizza, that's my yeah. favorite dish. I'm from California, and that's how we serve it up here. Mm. Thank you. And what about contestant number three? Probably, probably just some, uh, some ramen noodles, honestly. Thank you. Contestant number... Oh, yes, go on. I was gonna say, so what what kind of answer are you looking from from a it's from a man? Are you wanting someone that's gonna devour you or someone that's gonna uh, cook what? you a nice meal? I don't need a man to cook something for me. But I do like a man that has some culture, you know. Oh, excellent stuff. Okay, and on with the next uh, round of questions. Contestant number one. Do you think I'm dumb or sharp? Yeah, just you. Oh, I would, uh... No, I, I, I don't know, I, I, I feel like you're uh, a bit of both. I feel like sometimes you'd like to be dominated and uh, what did you say? other times you'd like to, uh, for us to take control. Thank you. So the question was, do you like to be dominated or not? No, if I'm dominant or submissive. Oh, if you if you're dominant or submissive. Okay, so dominant in the professional atmosphere, submissive in the bedroom. Mm, oh, I like that answer. Huh? And then of course, last one. What do you think? I would uh, I would honestly make you a submissive as shit in my uh, sex dungeon. Actually, handcuffs, whips, spikes, uh, clamps. I think you'd enjoy yourself, honestly. Like, mm. very much. Excellent. And so now we've we've got a bit of an idea of who the contestants are. We've got an idea of uh, of who Paloma is. Um, I think we should move on to to eliminating one of the contestants. I think you've you've got an idea of who they are now and who you might want to spend the evening with. Um, off of all of the questions that you've asked so far, who do you think that you'll be most attracted to, Paloma? Hmm. I would say one. Yeah, so, so you're liking yeah. one's answers so far. What, mm -hmm. what could you say to number yeah, two or number three to uh, to make them sort of s to rank higher in your opinion? You should like yellow. Contestant number two. Oh. So, so his favorite color is wrong. I understand. Yes. Okay, so, so you're liking one, and um, you know it's, it's a throw up between two and three. Um, one, who, who do you think has answered the best out of two and three? Hmm. They call it has to count a half one, you know, but I do think two has answered. A bit better, in my opinion. Okay, well, I'm going to ask you now to to eliminate one of the contestants. Um, who who do you think you'd like to send home first of all tonight? I, I wish I could send no one home because everyone sounds gorgeous. Yeah, but, but uh, oh just, uh, God. Just um. Hmm. I'm going to sadly send contestant number three home. Hey, what? Oh, no. oh, <laughs> oh there it sucks! It. it sucks to <laughs> suck! I'm so sorry to hear that. Okay, we're gonna have contestant hey, number three hey, reveal anything? themselves to Paloma, not in the in that way. So this this is contestant number three. Get ahead, honey. Do you do you feel like you're missing out here, Paloma? Do you feel like you've made a bad decision or or not? You have the right to remain sexy. Anything could do will be used against you in the sex dungeon. You have the right to a safe word, but you will not be needing that because you have the greatest time of your life. You know how to find me after, honey. 
I'm not too far away. Just put your distress curl in and I'll be right there in a happy. All right, sweetie? Oh, my God. I'll come and save you from that horrendous day. I have to ask, where was, where Much was love, this? Much love, Buttercup. Where was this um, you when soon, you sweetheart. were uh, on the stool? What can I say? I'm, I'm a man of faith, you know what I'm saying? I don't like yeah. to hide behind walls, you know? My confidence is through the roof, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right. Norman! Okay. Can I just 77, say he... Norman Sawyer at. Can I just say he's not employed by LSPD? <laughs> what a guy. No, you no, 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 okay. What a no, 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 so we'll, we'll move on now to the next round of questions. <laughs> We've had one elimination now, and uh, we are left with, with bachelors one and two. We'll move straight to uh, Paloma. We're going to ask you, how are you feeling having, um, you know, having eliminated one of the bachelors from the lineup? You want my honest opinion? Of course, as always. I feel bad, but... Choices have to be made, you know. Oh, you can end up in the bedroom with the three of us, but, you know, I don't think that's what we're looking for today, is it? Of course not. I mean, we are looking for true love tonight, Paloma. True yes, love for indeed. you. So we're going to move on to the second round of questions. Um, you've only got two, two uh, contestants left to ask. So... Um, We'll have you indicate which one you'd like to answer first, but we'll get both of them to uh, to, to give their answers for each question on this. Let's start with contestant one. On what date number do you put out? Oh, see now that's a that's a tricky one because uh, I'm a giver. No, I'm not a taker. So uh, I'll bend you up like a pretzel on date one. Yo! Oh, time. Oh. Oh. Honestly, I'm kind of turned on by this. I'm not gonna hide it. Actually, I test has the same question to contest the number two. Could the question be repeated? Is that the Zohan? Of course. Well, what date number do yes. you put out? What date number do I put out? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I don't understand the question. My apology. Oh, when do you want to have sex? Oh, dude. Oh, 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 I get it now. What date no, do you put out? Yeah, yeah, I, I, I hear it now. I can understand it. Um, I put out usually on the first date. That's just how I've always gone, you know? Uh, you, you know oh, boy. It's, uh, if you, if you charm them well enough, you know, and the vibes are right, I don't see anything wrong with that. Understandable. Thank you. Contestant number one. What is your opinion on witchcraft? What? Can you repeat the question? What is your opinion on witchcraft? My opinion on witchcraft? Whew. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm up for all that sort of spooky shit. I light some candles in a room and sing some, uh, some weird kind of juju. Uh, yeah, I'm... Um, I oh, know. I'll be Harry Potter. You can be Hermione. Let's go for it. Oh but damn! Then oh, they don't end up together, though. Yeah. But then you both have lunch. We all wish they do. We want you better. Man, these guys okay. Without the wands? Yeah. Shut up, Bruce. There's gonna be at least one, one wand here. Oh, your mum. Asher, my God. <laughs> Next question. Contestant number two. What do you think about vampires? What do I think about what? Vampires. Vampires. I like you them. Said suck your blood. Yes, I like them because I like to get sucked off. So they, they, I have an I'm appeal to vampires for sure. What the fuck? Hey yo. Hey yo. Settle down, settle down. I do. That's not a clap for an answer. <laughs> um. <laughs> Contestant number two. Where do you see yourself in five years? Dead. I see myself owning a mansion with a Ferrari and you in my it's castle. Not dead. Not dead. Basic the mansion bitch package. The is Are you a cager? Isn't it? Mm. Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it. Contestant number one. 
really wish I could see a problem. Was uh, where do I see myself in five years? Mm -hmm. Well, hopefully, it's compound. It's, uh, <laughs> Shut up. riding down an open highway with no plan, just a pocket full of cash, and you on the back of my bike. Thank you. Condition number one. Why should I choose you to be my blind date? Why should I be picked as the blind date? Mm -hmm. Because uh, I'll spit in your mouth and <laughs> and uh, what? you can be the uh, the second set of my eyes. Oh my god. Hmm. Okay. Oh. number two. What qualities does the woman of your dreams have? Woman of my dreams has humor, charisma, intelligence, and don't forget sex appeal. Thank you. Number one, I'll just call you that for now. Um, I do know I run the city pretty damn bad, but that's beside the point. Um, how would you run the relationship? How would I run the relationship? Uh, hopefully not into the ground. So, that'll be a good start. Thank you. Excellent. I think we'll, uh, we'll have you have a think to yourself, Paloma. Um, how do you think that that round of questions went? Do you think that you got the answers that you needed? Um, yes, I do think so. Did you do you feel like the questions you asked were were important? Do you think that they were all um, integral parts of of who you are that you'd need to know before you got involved with someone? Mm, mainly everything yes. Um, there's always something that are deep deep down that you, of course, don't speak of yet. Of course. Okay. Well, have you have you uh, had a th have you had a think about um, the answers? Have you had a think about who who you're hoping to take home tonight? Hmm. Let me think. Who who are you hoping? Who are you wanting to take home tonight, Paloma? Hmm. I would want to take everyone home tonight for a nice cup of tea. Or something else in mind but i would have to choose so um i would say one you're gonna say one you are taking home contestant number one bachelor one yes. that's my yeah. thank you so that's much my man. Woo. Yeah. so we we're gonna have we're gonna have first of all we'll have uh contestant number two come round and we'll see who you said no to tonight here we have Bachelor yeah, number two. On the nice to meet you. You as well. And sorry it didn't work out for you tonight. Oh, uh, My apologies. There can only be one, sadly. There can only be one. Thank you so much for your um, participation. We'll have contestant number one now come round. This may be a surprise to you, but here you go. Yes, We've got contestant is. number one is <laughs> TJ. Oh, We've got you. Taylor Jackson. Let's go. That's my brother. That's my fucking oh, brother. Ooh, uh, God damn. It's they it's they it's spear it's running it. Oh, jeez. Hey, Norman, how do you like that, Michael? And let's pretty take that out. Is he folding it like a pretzel? Tonight, you two are going on a all expenses paid holiday to Cayo. We may die. Don't die. But it's all about it's all about the tropical weather and the and the beautiful beats on the beach. Tell me, Paloma, were you expecting to find such a, rug, a rugged, handsome man like this today? Um. No, I'm off. I'm more expected a rat or something. But yes, I'm. I'm happy what I found. And TJ, were you expecting to be picked by the one and only mayor of Los Santos? Uh, actually, no, I wasn't. I, I, I thought I'd just jump at the chance, and I've not been in a relationship for a while now. So, I, 
you, you don't uh, you don't hit the, the holes you don't shoot for, you know? Of course, and so you've certainly shot for a uh, a prominent hole here tonight. This has been Moira Black for Blind Date. We've had Paloma Swinton, and she has picked contestant number one, TJ. They are going to be heading on their holiday shortly, and you'll be able to catch up with us next time to find out exactly how their date went when we uh, set up the next lucky couple.